Osaka Metropolitan University. COVID-19 continues to shape our society in many ways. Research at Osaka Metropolitan University utilizes the latest medical information, antivirus measures, and social statistics surrounding the coronavirus to help mitigate the effects of the pandemic and strengthen Japan for what may come. Focusing on the effectiveness and safety of COVID-19 vaccines and vaccine-preventable diseases is Professor Wakaba Fukushima. As part of our research group for the Japanese Ministry of Health, Labor and Welfare, we provide scientific evidence to support national disease control programs. Our team contributes to society by combining the strengths across all academic fields at our university. We hope that our findings help the public better understand COVID-19 vaccines. Workers on the front line of pandemic defense are at the highest risk of infection. Dr. Hiroki Namikawa's research provides the government with analytical results to better understand their situation and decrease any risks. Our research found the frequency of exposure to at-risk care was significantly higher among nurses. The prevalence of physical symptoms among nurses was at 39.5%. I believe that this study is a first step toward establishing a physical health management strategy for healthcare workers who take care of COVID-19 patients. Using plants as a host, Professor Tomofumi Mochizuki explores how they produce antigens against the coronavirus with the hopes of better controlling the disease. Since the beginning of 2020, when COVID-19 became a global issue, our lives and research activities have been restricted. Thus, we started the research project using plant viral vectors to produce coronavirus proteins on plants. If we can establish a method to produce coronavirus proteins on plants, it can be used to implement countermeasures against COVID-19. The first nationwide survey conducted in Japan, which identified how COVID-19 has affected children and parents in economically disadvantaged households and the child support organizations such as schools, welfare centers, and temporary shelters was carried out by Professor Noriko Yamano. We summarized our findings into a policy paper. The Ministry of Education pays attention to our work and the Cabinet Office plans to reflect this report into their rule design. To quickly and surely address the problems of children during the COVID pandemic, we would like to further develop our current screening study that I believe helps improve society for children. With its array of disciplines, Research at Osaka Metropolitan University uses a diverse approach to challenge today's issues for a sustainable tomorrow.